now let us discuss here about uh, gray code so we are mainly going to discuss here about how to convert a binary number to the gray number as well as a gray code to the binary code so let we have a binary number like this 100110 now let us convert this binary number into the gray code so the procedure is very very simple so this bit is called as uh, leftmost bit is called as most significant bit whereas this rightmost bit is called as uh, least significant bit here we need to perform xr operation uh, xr means uh, exclusive or operation we know about uh, exclusive or operation uh, if the bits are same the result is zero so that means zero exclusive or zero is equal to one as well as one exclusive or one is equal to zero why because zero exclusive or zero the bits are same one exclusive or one the bits are same so the result is zero whereas if the bits are different then the result is one so zero exclusive or one equal to one bits are different so the result is one one exclusive or zero is equal to bits are different so the result is one here we have to perform xr operation so here we have to keep most significant bit as it is so there is no difference in the most significant bit next we have to perform the xr operation so let us perform xr operation and what is one x one exclusive or zero one so we have to write that one here next let us perform exclusive or on these two bits xr operation so what is the result of zero exclusive or zero zero next let us perform xr operation on these two bits so zero exclusive or one means one next let us perform xr on these two bits one exclusive or one means zero next let us perform xr operation on these on these two bits one exclusive or zero means one so this is the gray code for this binary number now let us turn that <coughs> gray code into the binary code okay vice versa let us convert gray code into the binary code so let the gray, gray code is this number only 11110101 so let us convert this gray code into the binary code so we need to keep the most significant bit as it is next we have to perform xr operation on this on these two bits so on these two bits we have to perform the xr operation one exclusive or one means what is the result zero is the result so let us write that zero here next we need to perform xr operation on these two bits so zero exclusive or zero means zero so let us write that zero here next let us perform xr operation on these two bits zero exclusive or one means one next let us perform xr operation on these two bits one exclusive or zero means what is the result one let us perform xr operation on these two bits on these two bits so one exclusive or one means zero so what is the binary number 100110 so 100110 is nothing but binary number so in this way we can convert binary number into the gray code as well as uh, gray code to the binary number uh, here uh, gray code is called as uh, unit distance code gray code is called as unit distance code why because in gray code the successive binary numbers differs by one okay let us take this table here this is the decimal numbers four bit binary number so if we have four bit binary number then totally we can write two power four numbers so 16 numbers from 0 to 15 we can write so these are the binary numbers and these are the corresponding gray numbers for these binary numbers so let us take some example let us take 0 1 double 0 0 1 double 0 so for 0 1 double 0 this is the gray code so let us convert that so 0 means we have to keep msb as it is next perform the xr operation 0 exclusive r1 means 1 so 1 exclusive r1 means 1 exclusive r0 means 1 next 0 exclusive r0 means 0 so for 0 1 double 0 what is the xr code 0 double 1 0 okay so these are the binary numbers and these are the gray numbers for the corresponding binary numbers okay if you take 0 double 1 0 
if you take 0 double 1 0 then what is the gray coat so keep the 0 as it is 0 exclusive r 1 means 1 1 exclusive r uh, 1 exclusive r 1 means 0 1 exclusive r 1 means 0 so this is 0 0 exclusive r 1 means 1 yeah uh, it is uh, yeah next one exclusive r1 means zero one exclusive r1 means yeah let us write uh, top. so zero double one zero so let us consider this number so keep this zero as it is zero exclusive r1 means one next one exclusive r1 means zero one exclusive r zero means what one so zero one zero one so this is the uh, uh, corresponding gray number so first column represents decimal numbers second column represents uh, binary numbers and the third column represents the gray code for the corresponding binary numbers. If we observe the gray numbers, if we observe the successive binary numbers, so these two are successive binary numbers, these two are some successive binary numbers, these two are some successive binary numbers, likewise. If we observe here, here if we consider these two numbers, so the first two three bits are same, only the last bit differs. So unit distance code means two successive binary numbers differs by only one bit. So if we consider these two binary numbers, okay, here the first two, two bits as well as the last bit is same only. Here only one bit differs. Here we have 0, here we have 1. If we consider these two binary numbers, okay. So here the first bit, third bit and the fourth bit for the, these two binary numbers are same only. These two binary numbers are differs by only one bit. So if we consider the last two binary numbers, last two, two binary numbers, okay. So first number, first bit, second bit and the last bit, same only. So these two are differs by only one bit. Okay. So that's why gray code is also called as unit distance code. Unit means the successive binary numbers differs by only one bit. Gray code can also be called as unweighted code. Unweighted code. Unweighted or non-weighted code. Unweighted or non-weighted code. If we take a binary number or B series number, we have some weights. 8421 notation binary code or decimal code means binary code or bcd code means we follow 8421 notation whereas in gray code we don't have any weights so that's why gray code can also be called as non weighted code so let's see where we can use gray code so gray codes are mainly useful in carnal map so in carnal map simplification we have to draw some table so that uh, table will be drawn based upon the gray code only and gray codes are mainly useful for data transmission so we can use gray code for data communication or data transmission data communication for error recovery data communication means data will be transmitted from the sender to the receiver uh, so if there are any errors then uh, the errors will be recovered very very easily with the help of the gray code why? Because here the uh, successive binary numbers differs by only one bit. So this is about what is gray code and how to convert binary to gray code and gray to binary code.